And welcome back, everybody. We're gonna have, taking a look at our six-hour time lapse here. Plenty of sunshine. We did have a few tiny wisps of cloud coming through earlier this morning, but otherwise nothing major to give us any shadowing. We are going to have 64 right now in San Angelo with winds coming in from the east at 16 miles an hour, so a bit of a breeze coming in. So we do have temperatures sitting mostly in the low to mid 60s as we get through our early afternoon, but those humidity levels are definitely a lot lower. I mean, we're looking closer to this dry end here. We're looking at 20s down to the teens. We're not going to be dropping too much more as we continue through our day. Now, these temperatures are going to be sitting. We've got a lot of 50s and 60s across the Lone Star State at this time. So we'll heat up a little bit more. Air quality index for this afternoon. Next number is actually going to be a little bit better today. 29 is that number. We're still dealing with those pollen levels. Very similar to what we had, like I said, the last couple of weeks. We still have plenty of freeze watches and warnings off to the east and northeast of Texas. Still have lingering showers up in the very northeast, up in Maine there. But for our region, nada. We got sunshine all day, and I don't think anyone's going to really complain about it. I mean, maybe some people will, but for those of us who do enjoy the sunshine, we're going to have plenty of that for the rest of today, and those winds will shift a little bit coming in from the southeast direction, about 10 to 15 miles per hour as we get through the rest of our afternoon. Now, highs are expected to be in the low 70s today, so it will be slightly warmer than yesterday, but we're still going to be below average as we get through our Thursday. Now, 46 tonight is expected for an overnight low in San Angelo. We're going to have an increase in cloud cover, and those winds will still be coming in from the southeast, 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tomorrow, we're going to have mostly cloudy skies. A few peaks of sunshine going to be in the afternoon. Highs expected in the upper 60s to low 70s, and we may have a few spotty showers coming in as we head into the evening hours. Now, we're still going to be below average as we head into tomorrow, but warmer air is going to start trying to make its way into our area, but not quite getting into the Contro Valley. Like I said, mostly cloudy tomorrow. We'll have some showers come through, and then Saturday, as we head into noon, we may have a few breaks from the clouds, but still going to be dealing with an option, an opportunity for some rain showers. Now we're going to head to Easter Sunday. We are going to see chances of showers, overcast conditions, 73 expected for a high winds from the south at about 5 to 15 miles per hour. So that could hinder opportunity for outdoor activity on Easter Sunday. And looking into next week, we are going to see those temperatures getting into the mid to upper 80s, close to 90 degrees next week on Wednesday with a mix of sun and clouds. Coming up after the break, we'll be with Charlotte Anderson from Keep San Angelo Beautiful. You're watching KLST News at noon. We'll be right